Cool legendary hero and his amazing assistant, Drexton! How you guys been? Holy cow, it has been forever! It's been months or like since years. we have made a Zelda video. It has been forever. The last time I recorded something was back during New Year's. Like, literally. Like, yeah. literally. Go to my latest video right now and you'll see. December 31st, 2015 is the last time I uploaded. And right now it's March 10th, 2016. So you can tell that I have been away from YouTube for quite a long time. So, but apologize for all about that because what can we say? Life, work, so on. But anyway, let's just get out of that way. We don't need to deal with our problems in this video. How y'all been? I have been wonderful. I am so glad to be able to finally start recording again because I have been missing you guys. I've been missing you fellow viewers. I've been missing recording. I've been missing playing some Zelda for you guys because it's fun. I love doing this. So, yeah. So last time we played Ocarina of Time, guys, um, we were getting ready to go to the Zara area. And of course, we made it through Zor's River, got a gold scotilla, saw the owl again, told us some wisdom. Um, we saw a cuckoo, we met a bean seller, we got a heart piece, and then we tried to get another heart piece, but then we miser miserably failed. But at the end of the video, guys, um, you'll probably see something pretty interesting about that one heart piece I missed. Um, if you guys remember me saying, I will off screen it. Um, I already did that, so if you guys um, wait till the end of the video to see how you get that heart piece, um, you can do that. If you want to, or even right now, just skip towards the end of the video, and you'll or kind of towards the end of the video, and you'll see how to get that heart piece. So, and then of course we got got to good old Zora's domain, and um, we did very little stuff, not too much, because um, I had to leave. That one time I ended the recording, so. But enough of me chatting, because I have been chatting for actually like a good amount now. So let us explore Zora's domain, because I am tired of just walking around here. So, alright, guys. So, alrighty. So let's kind of explore, see if there's any Zoras we can talk with. So, I guess we can smash some pots along the way, because. It's not a Zelda game if you don't smash pots. Alrighty. Zora shop. We have fresh fish. Eh, we don't need to go back. Oh, whoa. Looks like the torch has been, like, it's not lit. Maybe we'll have to do something with that. Um, hey, what's up, buddy? Who are you? Who are you? I'm, I'm Link. Uh, who the heck are you? We are the Zoras, the proud aquatic people. So you say you have some connection with Hyrule's royal family. Well, what do you want from us? Well, I was wondering if you knew where a spiritual stone, someone named Princess Ruto, because we weren't sure who the heck that was last time. And how to get past King Zora. Uh, I don't know. Well, you're useless then. All right, guys. So, well, looks like another torch. So we're gonna have probably have to do some of them torches. It looks like there's rocks in the water. Really odd. Right oh, looky here, another Zora. What's this? We Zora serve the great King Zora. That's 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 good information. Probably the best text in the game, maybe. No, no it's not. I don't know what I'm saying. Come on. 
Okay, what's up, buddy? No, Link, don't die. Have you seen Lord Jabu Jabu? Who the heck is Lord Jabu Jabu? No, I, I've never heard of that. Oh, that's not good. Okay, okay, that's not good. I've never heard. What do you mean? Everybody who comes around here should see Lord Jabu Jabu at least once. Well, as of right now, until I figure out who the heck that is, I don't know. And maybe I don't want to visit him. Thor's fountain is just beyond King Zor's throne. That is where Lord Jabu Jabu swims. But, unless you have King Zor's permission, you can't go to Zor. Okay, that's really weird. So it had but at the be text before it had but dot 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 and then they what they couldn't put but on this text or something? I feel like that could have been maybe a little bit better text. I don't know. The text is a little odd. All right, maybe one more Zora and then we'll s guess see King Zora again maybe. We are good at diving. How about you? I'm actually a pretty good diver. If you want to be a di master diver, try the diving yeah, on top of the water. Bro. Have you tried it already? No, but thank you, my good Zora friend. We need to do the diving thing, actually. Because we said our last time, we talked with the diving person, but we didn't play his game because we were running out of time. So... We're gonna go and actually first we need to do some with those torches. Those torches just seem so dull, and there's nobody lighting them up. Hey, King Zor, how you doing again? Um, we'll try and figure out who this Princess Ruta you're talking about with. So we're gonna first of all we're gonna play with fire because we need to light up them torches. Yeah. Playing fire. Let's, get, let's sing that song. Burn, baby, burn. Disco inferno. Burn, baby, burn. Burn that. Whoa, whoa, what? No. What is up? The guys, did you see that? For some odd reason, my Deku stick is really small. Like you see this? It's so small. It's not big. What is this? What, what is this? It's so small. Did you guys see that? Uh, whatever. So it looks like after lighting all those torches, guys, we have got a treasure chest. Oh, sweet. We got a piece of heart. We have collected three pieces. So if we get one more, we'll be able to get a, another heart container. Alright, guys. Now we're going to go do that diving game because. Thanks to Mr. Zora, buddy, telling us about diving. We need to go do that. So. How you guys been, by the way? Um, hopefully you guys have been doing good. Um, here on the western side of the U.S., it's spring break. So, if you're on the western side of the U.S., um, hopefully you're having a good spring break. If your spring break isn't here yet, um, hopefully you'll have a wonderful spring break. Because, yeah. Hey, here's Mr. Diving Guy. Diving Game 20 Rupees. Want to play? Yes, we would love to play. Thank you. Okay. Oh, actually, okay. All capitalized with exclamation point. Yeah. Pick up all the rupees I throw from here. And you only have a limited time. Oh. Alrighty. So we gotta make sure we, we're gonna go quick, guys. We gotta go. Gotta go fast. All right. So then once we have him picked up, it looks like we gotta come back here and he'll give us something amazing. So tosses rupees from his fin, so that's cool. Alright, stopped. Alright guys, we're gonna dive. Alright, oh, there we go. Yeah, buddy. Oh, that was a double rupee right there. Oh. Yeah. All right, and we need this one. And we got one, one more. Hey, congratulations. I've got something very nice for you. Come and get it. All righty. I feel like 
we spent 20 rupees, but then we just got it back. Don't you feel like that's what we did, guys? We just, we spent money, but we got it back. I don't know. Like, it's kind of weird. Like, I guess if you're low on rupees and you need some, but you got to make sure you at least have 20 rupees. Um, the game does change up a bit. It's not always um, blue. It might be green, red, maybe even purple. Because purple's 50. I don't know. But if you guys are ever low on money, you can come here. So what? what is it? What are you going to give us? What a graceful letter. Now please take this. This is a scale of our kind. With this, you can dive much deeper underwater. Under the water. And we got a silver scale. So now we can dive a lot deeper than what we could before. So we can only dive for like three. We were only able to only dive like for amount of three times. Now we can dive for amount of six times. So for example, see, so now that thing it shows six instead of three. So that's pretty cool. So what is this the area down here? This is pretty interesting. We need to figure out who this Princess Ruto is as well. Oh, guys, you see that underwater? What, what is that? Oh, wait. What's up? I am Azora. Have you seen anything strange in the lake? The river carries many things into the lake. Well, by strange, there is a odd bottle down here. I wonder what that is. What, Navi, what's that? What's like a bottle? Well, let's dive and get this bottle, because I'm curious. Oh, we got it! We got an empty bottle! Well, actually, kind of an empty bottle. Put something inside and proceed to use it. Wait, what? Something's already inside it. Yeah, not considered an empty bottle, if you say it that way. What is this? We got a really odd message, guys. We need to see what this is. So, oh, as you guys can tell, we're in Lake Hylia. Forgot to say something. Yeah, so, there's a shortcut to Lake Hylia, but what in the world is this? What is this? Huh? It looks like there is something already inside this bottle. It's a letter. Help me, I'm waiting for you inside Lord Jabba Jabba's belly, Ruto. Yes, don't tell my father. So this is a freaking letter of Ruto. I'll tell you right now, she has perfect handwriting. I wish I could write like that. So, well, this seems very urgent, guys. So we better um give this to King Zora because this seems very important. And maybe we can figure out a little bit more about this Princess Ruto, because apparently she said in the bottle she is inside Lord Jabu Jabu's belly. And we need to figure out who Lord Jabu Jabu is well. So Alright King Zora, what's up buddy? Oh, uh, I think we might have found a clue of who maybe this Princess Ruto person is. Maybe maybe this letter will help you out. Call me oh bro! Whatever did to you? Oh, this letter. It's from Princess Ruto. Hmm, let's see. She's inside Lord Jabu Jabu. That's not possible. Our guardian god, Lord Jabu Jabu, would never eat my dear Princess Ruto. But since that stranger Ganondorf came here, Lord Jabu Jabu has been a little green around the gills. The evidence seems clear. Of course, you'll go. Of course, you'll go find Ruto. You can pass through here to the altar of War of ja uh, of Lord Jabu Jabu. Gosh dang it, grammar! What can I say? I'll keep this letter. You keep the bottle. It was in. Take it respectfully. What? What? I take everything respectfully. Please find my dear Princess Ruto immediately. Zora. Now you think I'm a Zora? Oh, now we gotta wait seven years, guys. Alright. Almost there. 
Almost there. Oh, almost there. So, how you doing? How you doing? Alrighty, after seven years, we finally see the good old fish move, and he has moved out of the way into another dimension. So, I guess we can go see what this is. See what this area is. And, we are... Holy cow, that is a giant fish! And we're in Zora's Fountain. But who is this fish? Zora's Fountain. Don't destroy Lord Jabu Jabu. King Zora. Um. I'm going to say the sixth? No? So ten? The sixteenth? What can we say? Roman numerals. But holy cow, so this is Lord Jabu Jabu. Hello, buddy. Huh. Can't get in your belly. Well. Alright, guys. I feel like it's probably time for us to wrap it up. Because I think it's been a very fun episode. So. Alright, guys. Um. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um. I sure did. And then hopefully next time we can figure out how to get into good old Lord Jabu Jabu's belly. Because I'm kind of curious. So, alright guys. Make sure you to like, subscribe, and I'll see you next video. So, peace! And Link, don't go to bed. Because we're probably going to be recording some more soon. So, bye!